Hey, what's good, family? Um, yeah, in this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to create auxins using Machine 2. Um, so why do you want to use an auxin? Uh, there's a couple of good reasons. Um, one that comes to mind is that it's a lot more efficient to uh, if you want to use the same uh, effect on multiple sounds, it's more efficient to use one than to insert that same sound on um, multiple sounds. Let me give you an example. Um, I have this sample um, that's on two different pads. Um, I kind of want to make it, you know, make it sound like it's one sound using the same effect. So how that how is that done? Um, let's go to our mixer window um, and we see the sound. It's on uh, pad nine and ten. Um, Normally, I would just go in and insert, you know, the reverb or delay or whatever effect I want on this sound. Um, however, there's another way to do it. I can use the send, so I want to use the same reverb for these two sounds. Um, so how that's done? Um, if you don't see these aug augs um, send knobs down here, then you want to click over here where it says AUX. It'll show the augs. Um, now what I want to do is go over to any available group. In my case, I'm going to use group B. I'm going to label this my effects group. Just to keep things tidy and organized. Um, so I have available to me, available to me um, 16 different um, effect chains I can set up. Um, so to do this, I'm just going to go to my first sound and I'm going to insert a reverb. Uh, go to your internal um, reverb. Now, I'll go back to my group A and my sound that I want to use. Down here on my auxes, now I'm going to assign this. Now you see how it, set, how it already shows up here. It's in group B, effects group, and it says reverb. It's already labeled. So I assign that here, and on my other sound, I assign the same one. Now if I did it right, I should have a reverb going on both sounds. Yep. So, um, take a step further, I want to put a delay on that same, those same two sounds. So I'm going to go back to my effects. I want to assign beat delay on, oops, I did it wrong, I'm sorry. On sound two, I want to assign beat delay. I go back to my A group, my same two sounds. Now I should have a delay I'll exaggerate a little bit on both sounds. Um, yeah, so um, machine makes only two available auxes available to you, but like I said, you can do 16 different uh, effect sends. So but only two are available at one time. But the cool thing is that you can set up 16 of these. And um, what's another cool thing that you can do is that you can chain effects. And let's just say I wanted to do um, a delay. That feeds into a reverb. That feeds into, uh, let's say, I don't know, a distortion. So you can set up an effect chain such as this, and then let's see how that's going to sound. I have no idea. Um, we set that up on sound three. Let's just see what that sounds like. Um, so I guess you get the idea. Um, that's basically how you uh, set up effect sends on Machine 2.0. Um, 
you can play around and have fun with that. Um, any questions about this, feel free to hit me up.